Hi, this is Linda with Gacy Creations by Linda, taking you on a tour of my latest journal. It's called Retro Diner. If you were fortunate enough to live back in these times, these were it was a fun place to go. It's where all the kids met after school, had french fries and a Coke. It was a great place. So I found this paper and decided I'd bring it back. Here's your front. That's what the old diners, some of them used to look like. Little dangles here. There's a what we call the fountain coke, some french fries, some chicken nugget things, and a sundae. Those were our popular things, other than hamburgers. It does measure nine by six. It's got a four and a half inch spine, and it's got a hard cover. There's three signatures in it. They're held together with the twine here. That way you could slide them out if you want, slide them back in. Its closure is a red chiffon ribbon that measures the bow and, or excuse me, matches the bow. And there's some blue and some yellow, which is also colors throughout the journal. I have finished off the ends so that they thread through the grommets very easily. And here's your first section. There's the jukebox. Used to cost a quarter. Put it in. We all have our favorite songs, which played over and over and over. There's another image of one of the old diners. There is one of the drinks we used to have. Coke and ice cream. It's very interactive. It's got a flip here, a little pocket, and all of the pockets I have made where they finish the image underneath. So you remove the cards and you've got the full picture. There's one of the fountain cokes, there's a jukebox, and they're all back with an additional layer of cardstock so they're very durable and they don't bend as easily. It's got to pull out from the top. There's one of the hamburgers, and they really used to look like that. And they were wonderful. Little hot dog on a platter there. Lined paper. And anytime you see a ribbon or anything out of the top of a card, there's going to be a metal eyelet to protect the hole so it doesn't tear out on you. open. We've got an angle pocket here. There's one of the servers. Hot dog. Little flip here. And I fussy cut out one of the hamburgers there. Whoops. To make a little tuck spot for these tiny little cards. And everything has been distressed ink all around the edges. Does have a pull out from the side. Lots of journaling space in this journal. Opens up. I cut out one of the labels to make a little tuck spot for these little cards. There's a hamburger with fries and a Coke. Here we've got a big pocket that holds these cards. There's another jukebox. There's the guest check. Just write your order on. And here I just made a dangle out of a little fussy cuts diner windows there. Open again. We've got a big band here. Completes the ice cream float underneath. The old plastic covered chairs and the metal tables. And on this side, we have a little flip going this way cut out the hot dog there to make a little tuck spot. Tiny little guest check. There's the bar stools up against the counters. Pull out from the top. It swings open. Maybe 
little pocket there. Oops, cherry pie. This little pocket here. Get these cards. And you can see the old metal table. drinks. Flips open this way. I have a fussy cut out one of the french fries there. And here I took the paper, made another copy, and made little pockets sweet little tags. Kind of windows again. French fries. Record. Here, this one holds this tiny little guy. Flips open. Box and the servers. There's the booths. And here, with this large tag, and here it finishes the image. I'll scoot this out of the way so you can see the big card here. It's got a flip here. I put a little acetate window there. It's got to pull out. You can see her underneath there. Just open a little pocket here. Acetate window there, and this card pulls out. You can see the jukebox under there. And it opens up. Big space here, another big acetate window. Again. Here's our second section. I love these colors. They're so bold and vivid. We've got another flip here. In the pocket. There's the diner at night. Pull out from the top. I've cut out piece of cake, hot dog with all the trimmings, Oops, open, angled pocket there, a little flip at the top, there she is. And these checks, the floors were either black and white, checkered, linoleum, or red and white. And sometimes turquoise. That wasn't a big color, though. 
these little guys. Let's open another angled pocket. Big pocket here. Should the diner there. There's some money. Your check. Cup of coffee. You'll register. And there's a couple there. Swings open. Got a side band here. There's the image underneath. This looks like a chocolate coke. We have all different flavors. Over here, big flip here. Out of pocket. This little pocket. A little card and made into a pocket. Take this little card. And it has a pull up also. The little bulb pins, they work just like safety pins. You can open them up, take something off, put something on, whatever you would like. you do want a platter that means that you wanted the whole arrangement the fries the hamburger the top flip here it's got to pull it out from the bottom hot dog hamburger This pocket finishes the jukebox. I've got a big belly band here. There's an old diner. Looks like it's closed. The floor is all coming up. The paint's peeling there. open. Got a big pocket here. Got our french fries. Pocket here for this card. Again, we'll scoot him out of the way here so you can see the card. There's a flip here, pull up from the top, it dangles another record. Let's open a big pocket here, another little flip. Another journaling spot there on the card. out these cards. There's another diner at night. And the jukebox.
this is your actual journal. It is tied twice with the twine. The pages are tied to the cover and the cover is tied to the spine. That way you can just slip it out right here under the twine. Journal in it or you can journal as is. And I put lace on the pages here. Thumb through them so you can get the idea. It's images that I have used throughout the journal. This writing space. There's some burlap with lace on it. And lace. Some red lace. And here's the center. So if you had any papers you wanted, you could just slide them right under there. Some lace. There is 80 double-sided pages. There's some gold lace. Ruffle lace. Burlap with lace on it. And there's the end. I hope you enjoyed the tour. I thank you for your time and joining me. Until next time, stay crafty. Bye-bye.